Hey everyone, this is going to be my product video for 2012. Um, you're going to be seeing multiple products that you may have seen in some of my past product videos. Um, I just tend to go back and forth between products throughout the year. So if you see something that you may be wondering, oh, do you still use that? It's not a thing that I don't use it. It's just I may be taking a break from a specific product to try other ones that I've used in the past. So you can refer to some of my past product update videos um, to see those kinds of products but you majority of the products I'm going to be showing are the same products that I've always been using um, they just may have been switched around here and there um, and the, the reason for the multiple products that I have is that I use them for different purposes throughout um, my relaxer stretches so one product may work really good when I have a fresh relaxer and one product works better when I'm anything after six or eight weeks post to twelve weeks post so I use these products for different purposes um, for my hair and when it needs it so the uh, olive oil shampoo which is by organic root stimulator I use that for clarifying once a month and then I have the Triple Moisture Neutrogena Shampoo, which is the one in the middle that's moisturizing. And I use the Alpha G Deep Moisture uh, Shampoo. And so the moisturizing shampoos I use weekly. Now, the reason why the Triple Moisture is in here is because I'm trying to use that up um, so I can continue on using the Alpha G. These now these are my deep conditioning products. There are two products that are missing from this clip, which I probably should have waited to um, do this video um, until I had the physical product in hand. The two products that should be in my deep conditioning video is the Organic Root Stimulator Replenishing Conditioner and the Organic Root Stimulator um, Hair Repair Nourishing Conditioner. Now I will put a link down to those products so you can physically see, I mean visually see what those products look like and those are the products that I currently do use within my um, deep conditioning regimen here and there. But the products that are shown in this clip is the Main Intel Moisturizing Texturizing Conditioner and you've seen that in my co-washing clip and then the Organic Root Stimulator um, hair mask and the Lustre Silk Shea Butter Cholesterol. Now the main intel for me is light protein, the um, hair mask in the middle is moisturizing and the Lustre Silk um, Shea Butter is moisturizing. The Organic Root Stimulator Replenishing Pack is light protein and the Organic Root Stimulator Hair Repair Nourishing Conditioner with the bamboo and um, banana extract is light protein as well. So those two products that are not shown are going to be in the bottom link in the um, description um, bar underneath this video. These products here are my co-washing products. Um, there's some herbal essence and then there's some VO5s in there. And then the main and tail moisturizing, texturizing conditioner is in there. And you'll see that in another clip of mine. But that is one of the uses I use for my main and tail is for co-washing. So it's with all my co-washing um, products. Because these are kind of um, thin um, co-washing products which make it easy for you to co-wash. So you want something kind of runny and thin just a little bit for co-washing. So... That's my co-washing products there. And so these are my leave-in conditioners that I have. I have the Chi Creatine Mist, um, Cantu Shea Butter, Leave-in Conditioning Repair Cream, and then I have Herbal Essence Long-Term Relationship Leave-in Protector. Now I have yet to get the new one. I'm still using up my old one. So um, that's why I still have the old product in that. Now, I use these all at different times. Some of these products I tend to use more than others, but this is just showing you guys what I personally have. And these here are my moisturizing products um, that I use to moisturize and seal. It's just a thing of which product I wish to use. Um, I do not use these all at one time. I just kind of, you know, do and pick what I, whatever I need for my hair at the time. 
The one in the white um, jar is the Elastic QP Olive Oil Mango Butter Moisturizer. Then in the middle is the Herbal Essence Long-Term Relationship Leave-In Protector, which can be used as a leave-in or a moisturizer. And then the Olive Oil um, Moisturizing Hair Lotion, which is by Organic Root Stimulator, I use that. And so these products are used to moisturize my hair and then I'll seal with an oil. And these here are more of my styling uh, products for when my hair is air-dried. Um, this one here is the... Organic Root Stimulator Edge Control. Um, over there is the olive, Organic Root Stimulator Olive Oil Smooth and Hold Pudding, which is really good for smoothing out, you know, that top half of your ponytail for your little flyaways. Um, I have Fruity the Earth Aloe Vera Gel, and then I have the Eco Styler Gel in the small little sample size. I'm planning on getting the large size. The hold on the Eco Styler Gel is really amazing, so I really like that. These here are my heat protecting products. Now some of these I kind of rarely use because I don't really use heat on my hair that often. Um, so over here is the Chi 44 Iron Guard. I tend to use those on my clip-ins if I want to straighten them. And the Chi Iron Guard is the red one towards the left. And then the Elastic QP Design Silk is um, a heat protecting as well as you can use it for roller setting. I tend to use that more for roller setting and it gives me an amazing feel. Um, the Nioxin Volumizing Reflectives Bliss Thermal Protector. I use that for a more um, blow drying and flat ironing. It gives my hair a really pin straight look. So I absolutely love that. Um, then I have the Olive Oil Heat Protectant Serum. And then the one with the cap missing that I've had for a long time, which is the IC Fantasia heat protectant serum. So I don't use all of these at once, it's just whatever I kind of grab first depending on what I need. Now I use this product at 9 weeks post and it made my hair look like I had a fresh relaxer. So um, I may be talking more about that a little bit later. Now these products here are kind of more for like shine. Um, the one over towards the left is the Carol's Daughter a Sugar Dip Vanilla All Over Sheen which is the one with the brown cap. This product has been discontinued and a new product that has been introduced is, um, I can't think of it, um, I tried it out at, at the mall. When I come up with the name, I'll put an annotation beside it. I don't know if it's a Moroccan sheen oil mist or something, but it was dope, so I have to get that. Um, but a good dupe for that, uh, a more um, affordable dupe, is the Do Girl Hair Polish Shine Mist which is the clear bottle there and that smells good. Um, and then I have the one and only Oregon Oil, which is the brown bottle. And then I have the pink little one, is the Ion um, Shine Serum. It says Silk Drops on it. And then I have Organic Root Stimulator um, Olive Oil Nourishing Sheen Spray. So. I don't really use these that often, so I have these for a while. And the last one that I'm showing is the Nioxin Smoothing Reflectives Fast Finish Hairspray. And this is an extra hold, but it's a soft hold. But you can control how much hold you want, uh, of course, by how much you spray. But I never really use this. So I have this for a while. So those are the products that I have. Like I said in the previous clips, I do not use them all at once. I tend to use specific products during different times when my hair needs specific products. Um, I'm not using like all shampoos at one time or all moisturizers at one time. I just kind of pick and choose what my hair needs at the time. And some products tend to work better for my hair during different times. So if you do have any questions as far as any products that I have shown, please feel free to um, put those down in the comment area and I'll try to answer that for you. And there will be some information about some products that weren't shown in the video that I do use in LinkedIn in the bottom info bar. And yes, I do not care how I'm looking right now because I don't. Um, so say something with, if you want to about my scarf, but I'm comfortable. Um, but... Again, thanks for watching. Questions, feel free to put those down in the comment area, and I'll talk to you guys later.